Hello Unlimited Friends, it's Zara back again with another question about applying the Law of Attraction in practical ways to our life. The question today is from Sarthak Arya and her question is about growing taller. So I'll read the question out to you and then I'll share my response. Uh, she says, I want to achieve a, go a growth spurt and I have seen success stories on the secret webpage and even saw NBA players achieve it within a short span of time. But I am confused. What should be my mindset and my daily ritual? So increasing your height is just like any other desire. You've asked, the universe will respond, and then you must allow Abraham's three-step process for manifesting. The problem that happens is that two things get in the way. These are Arya, these are the three, the sorry, the two things that are keeping you from getting the results that you want to get. The first one is your belief systems about growing taller. And the second one is attachment to the outcome. These two things are preventing you from getting results. Let me explain. What do I mean by beliefs? Well, there are so many beliefs about a growth spurt or increasing your height when you're older that you've already probably absorbed. Some of those beliefs are, oh, you know, uh, after, after you're 18, you're not going to grow all that much. But then you see people who are in their late 20s or even their 30s like myself who are able to put on an inch or two and sometimes four or five or six inches, right? So it's your belief. This, the second belief that people have is that it's not possible, that uh, height increase has to do with genetics and that is absolutely not true. Height, height does not necessarily have to do with genetics. The more you look at yourself as um, being short, then you perpetuate that. <coughs> and the more you observe the fact that other people in your family are short, then you perpetuate that because it's law of attraction. Whatever you think about and focus on is what you create more of. So what are some of the negative beliefs that you have on the subject of growing taller? What are you telling yourself? It can't happen for me. I'm too old now. It's in my family. How can I, you know, uh, change my genetics? You have to stop thinking these thoughts because they are contradictory to your main law of attraction belief. And your main law of attraction belief is all things are possible. If all things are possible, then this too is possible. And that's it. The second thing that is getting in your way is attachment to the outcome. What I mean by attachment to the outcome is that you look for the results. Measuring your height again and again, thinking that it should have increased, is creating attachment to the outcome and it is slowing you down. Looking for results slows you down. In law of attraction, what we say is, I want the universe to surprise and delight me. Those are Abraham's beautiful words. I want the universe to surprise and delight me. Now tell me something. If you're looking for the results every day, how is anyone supposed to surprise you? You can only be surprised if you're not looking. So, sweetheart, stop measuring your height. Trust that it is going to happen and leave it alone. And one day you will be surprised and you will be so delighted because you will have achieved a growth spurt while you were not looking and it will happen. So trust, trust is the key. Abraham's three-step process for manifesting. You've asked, source answers, and then you allow. But you've asked, while source is answering, your job is to trust. 
And if you trust, then it will automatically manifest. You don't have to do anything to manifest. See, Abraham says you don't have to effort. There is no ritual that you need to do. In fact, you need to take your mind off of it so that the universe can take control of it and surprise and delight you. So that's what I'm going to recommend for you, Arya. Just take your mind off of it. Take your mind off of it. Don't pay attention to it. And here are a couple of things that you can do to help your mindset on a daily basis. First of all, I hope that you prepare your day. And if you don't, then you should prepare your day. Number two, when you see people who are tall, instead of feeling jealous, appreciate them. Appreciate what they have. Because when you appreciate what someone else has, then the universe will bring that to you. Okay? So don't be jealous. And if you notice yourself feeling jealous, then you have to work on that vibration of jealousy and get over it and feel truly happy for those people who are tall and they have what you want. Okay? The, uh, the next thing that you can do is to visualize. Visualize yourself as being the height and shape and color and beauty that you want. See it. But don't see it to make it happen. See it as if you're going to watch a movie just for the enjoyment of watching the movie. Because when you do visualization in order to make something happen, it always backfires and you don't see the results. But if you play the movie in your head only with the objective of enjoying the movie, just telling yourself, isn't it so much fun? When I see myself six inches taller, doing those things, wearing those clothes, going shopping, hanging out with those people, that's enjoyment. And when you are enjoying yourself, you are high on the emotional scale. And when you are high on the emotional scale, the thing that you want must come. It is law. And that is what law of attraction is all about. So. That's all you have to do. Be thankful for where you are. Appreciate where you are. Whatever height you are today, appreciate it. Because that's one of the things that the universe wants you to do. The universe wants you to be okay with where you are and not complain about where you are. Because when you complain about where you are, where you are cannot change. So those are the things that you need to do, Arya. Two things, first of all, are getting in your way. Your belief system and your attachment to the outcome. You need to get rid of both of those and then follow the steps that I just, uh, just showed you to do. Okay? No jealousy, appreciation for where you are, visualization. Prepare, prepare. And everything will turn out as you want it to be. Believe, trust that all things are possible and they will be. Okay. Thank you again for your questions. And everybody who is watching uh, the replay, if you could please click on the subscribe button as well as the notification bell. I would really appreciate it. I would love to invite you back to my next video. And if you have a question that you would like an answer to, by all means, drop it in the comments and I will do my best to respond as soon as I can. And if you want to keep your question private, you can send me an email through my website, zmahoon.com. All right, folks, have a really good rest of the day wherever you are. And I will see you in my next video. And before I go, Arya, I want you to know that I am actually writing a book about height increase using the law of attraction. Um, it's going to take another month or two before it is out because I've just been busy with so many things. But stay tuned. That will be available soon. Take care, everyone, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.